Welcome to our next video. Today we are going to learn a routine. You can do it on floor, like on a straight line, um, on carpet, on the grass. I'm going to be doing it on a beam. So when we get back into the gym, the gym opens back up, then you guys will know this new beam routine that you can show your coach. And I want you guys to show your coaches. When you get to beam, I want everyone to be like, hey, I learned a beam routine over this break and I want to show you. And all the coaches will be so excited. So you guys got to do that, okay? But first we have to warm up and stretch. So let's go ahead and we're going to start with 25 squats. Our warm up today is going to be our conditioning. Um, so we're not going to have conditioning at the end. We're going to get it all over with right now, get our body warmed up and moving and our heart racing a little bit in the beginning. Then we'll go to the routine on beam. All right, so 25 squats, ready and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and last one, 25. Next, we are going to do a 20 second plank. You can go on your elbows, and it's just like a push up position, but you're on your elbows instead. We're gonna hold this for 20 seconds and start. I'm counting in my head right now. I'll tell you guys when we have five seconds left. And five, four, three, two, one. All right, we're going to 15 sit-ups. Again, you can put your feet under a couch, have a sibling or family member or someone hold your feet for you if you need to. We're gonna go all the way up, hands across your chest, 15 times, ready, go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and last one, fifteen. Then you're going to do 10 crunches. We're going to lie on our backs. Our feet are going to be up like this. We're just going to lift our head and our shoulders up off the ground. Ready? We're going to do 10 of these and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then hands are going to go under your booty or your back. And we're going to do 10 leg lifts. Ready? One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Great job. Now we are going to do 15 push-ups. Are you guys ready for these? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm taking a little break. <laughs> Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right, and then we're going to do ten tricep dips. You can do these on a couch or a chair. Your fingers face you. And 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 
seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, and ten mountain climbers. So these, I'm gonna do it slow motion first. I know we've done them before. Do a slow motion first, and then we'll do it for real. So you bring your knee to your elbow, and that's one. We're gonna do ten of them. Ready? You can go as fast or as slow as you need. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, it's time to stretch. Go ahead and circle those arms forward. And backwards. Stretch one arm across. Should be a little out of breath now. Your muscles should be a little sore. And the other arm across. If you're not, feel free to rewind this video and do that conditioning again. You can always do it at the end also. And then sit down. We're gonna sit down in our open pike. Feet together, toes pointed, arms up, and close pike. And straddle, arms up, reach over to one foot. And over to the other side. And to the middle. Let's roll out those ankles. And the other ankle. I'm excited to do this beam routine with you guys. It'll be a fun one. Something that all levels can do. There's modifications as well. Um, so, you know, you can switch it up depending on what you're comfortable with and what your level is. Let's stretch our wrists. Lean back, get a nice wrist stretch. And flip them over. And roll them out. We're going to do a seal stretch since we just did some ab work. I want to get that ab stretched out. Go ahead, seal stretch. Look up. Arms should be nice and straight. Legs are together. You can twist a little bit to side to side. And then push back to cat stretch. Notice the stretch in your shoulders. Should feel really good also. And let's move on to our routine. Okay, we are gonna work on a beam routine today, guys. Um, just a little thing that I've created. If you don't have a beam at home, which most people don't, that's okay. You can work on your lawn or a big space of carpet in your home as long as your parents say that's okay. Just try to do it in a straight line um, so you can pretend like you're working on a beam. Let's go, get, go ahead and get started. I'm gonna break it down piece by piece. We're gonna do it together, we're gonna learn together. We're gonna repeat steps so that we can get it down. All right, first things first, we're gonna sit down on our beam and we're gonna do a V set. So V set, legs are together, they're straight, toes are pointed. Then you're gonna straddle, and then V again. Then we are going to stand up with one foot, all the way up, hands out to the side, step, coupe, step, and then go for our half turn prep. So we learned our half turns in very thorough detail in a previous video. So I hope you guys remembered and have already watched that. Otherwise, you're gonna figure it out now. So we're gonna stop there. We're gonna go ahead and do that again. Here we go. So you're sitting and we're gonna do our V sit and our straddle and our V. Stand up, arms out to the side, step, coupe, step, half turn, prop. All right, you guys ready to move on? Okay, 
from here. You are going to do your half turn. So we're gonna go all the way around. And then you are going from here. You're going to step. And then you can either do a lever or a handstand here. I'm gonna do like a three-fourths handstand. So handstand or lever, pick up, stick it, hopefully. Step together, straight jump, tuck jump, straight jump, tuck jump, and then step, pivot turn. Okay, let's go ahead and do that last, the second part again. So we're gonna start at the half turn. So you're here, you half turn, step. I'm gonna do a lever this time, lever, Stand up, feet together, straight jump, tuck jump, straight jump, tuck jump, back and releve, and pivot turn. Great job, you guys ready to move on? Or should we do it all from the beginning? Let's do it all from the beginning. Okay, so we're gonna start in our V-sit again. Sitting down, V-sit, legs together, straddle, V, stand up, arms out to the side, coupe, half turn. Hopefully you guys are squeezing a lot tighter than I am. Step, lever, or handstand. Keeping those arms glued to your ears the whole time. Step together, straight jump, tuck jump. Irreleve, pivot turn. All right, let's move on from there. After our pivot turn, we are going to, so you're here, just finished our pivot turn. We are going to have our arms up to the side. You're going to step, kick, then you're gonna cross your leg over like this. So you're kind of in a coupe, but it's all the way over, and our arms are gonna come and cross as well. So cute little dance pose here. Let's do that one more time. You just came out of your pivot turn, step, kick, crossover. After this, you are going to your cartwheel. So you're here, step out, and cartwheel. Hopefully your guys' is, is prettier than mine. <laughs> and then step together, three really fast, Releve steps backwards. One, two, three, and pivot, and straight jump off, stick, and finish. We're gonna go ahead and try it all together. You guys ready for this? Let's start in that V sit, and straddle, and V, and stand up. Arms up nice and tall, then arms come out to the side. Step, coupe. Step, half turn, you're here. Step, lever or handstand. Step together, straight jump, tuck jump, releve, pivot turn. Arms up to the side, step, kick, crossover and cartwheel. <laughs> Not quite. Cartwheel, pretend I stuck that. Step together, one, two, three, side pivot, and straight jump off, stick, and finish. Great job, guys. And tune in next time. Here's your virtual high five.